Hello everyone, this is Porfect and welcome back to my Stardew Valley Let's Play series on the Wilderness Map. This is now the second of winter. And today we're going to do something we could have done a very, very long time ago, but I'm absolutely awful at doing some things. So let's talk to... Think about the poor frozen squirrels, the poor squirrels. Let's have a hug and a kiss. And let's check the casks. So we've got fully upgraded cheese. Two iridium cheese. Tell you what, that gives us 130 health back. And they give... I think our max health is 150. I think we might even start saving these cheese for instead of energy tonics. Because they're probably going to heal us fully. It's going to snow tomorrow. And... Spirits are very happy. Well, that's good. Well, uh, normally on a happy day, we should go to the Skull Cavern, but I'm not going to do that. You want to catch a squid? Okay, very good. And we could have given... Them... Actually, that's not what we need to do. We need to check down onto the beach to see if there's a Nautilus shell today. But besides that, the other thing that I want to do today is focus on our missions. Or quests, or whatever they're called. Let's quickly check in here. Oh, there's wine. So maybe we'll grab some um, star fruit and put those on so we can keep getting more wine. We're going to get heaps of wine in, in winter, so that'll give us a big gold boost. Um, but we're going to get quests today. So once I'm sort of finished running around here and selling all these, we are going to go into our mission log and see what missions we can finish today. So, before we do that we are going to quickly do a quick run around of our animals and we might even have a quick look in the slime. I think there should be slime eggs, yep, and there's a little slime running around. Very lonely. Look at our trees growing there. We'll have to keep remembering to check on our animals to make sure they've got plenty of hay every day because I think one day I'll probably forget and all of a sudden we'll have no hay left. So I think probably around the 12th we'll probably go and purchase more hay from Marnie. Now pigs aren't really going to be doing a whole lot for us in winter because they don't go outside and they don't collect truffles so we won't getting, be getting a whole lot from those. That's all very good. Let's keep getting rid of these and let's put those away. We've got some of those casks free now, so we might even put some of our cheese in there. Rabbit's foot! Two rabbit's foot on the same day. Well, that's that must. No wonder the spirits are very luck, happy with us. We've got spirits happy, we've got lots of good luck getting two rabbit's feet. So that's magnificent. And we are going to be keeping those. Although we might sell one just so we've got the collectibles done. But before we do that, let's grab our cloth. Two iridium eggs. Wow. I kind of don't want to use those. I kind of want to keep them as a collectible. I didn't know you could get iridium eggs. So I wonder how much they sell for. But we're not going to sell them. Let's chuck them there. So we are collecting <laughs> lots of different things. Two silver rabbit's foot. Did not even know you could get silver rabbit's foot. I knew you could get a rabbit's foot. Didn't know you could get a silver one. So let's let's maybe before we do anything else, let's check our missions and collect all the items we need to be able to do all those missions. So what have we got? We've got catch a squid. Well, that's no issue. We need a jade. I don't think we've got a jade. We need a pumpkin for Caroline. So let's do that. Where's the pumpkin? Pumpkin for Caroline. Very good. Then what do we need? We need Blackberry Basket for Linus. I do know where that is. Cow's Delight and Amaranth. Do we have an Amaranth? We do. Who's that for? That was for Marnie. So we'll give that to Marnie. Knee Therapy and a Hot Pepper. Do we have a Hot Pepper? We do. Okay, so they're the main ones. And let's see if we can finish off all these quests today. So, a bit of a spoiler alert. This is where you get um, Linus's um, basket, it is just here, so you can go in this area, um, so let's grab that now, yep, we found the berry basket, 
We probably should have got it for him in fall, because then he would have been able to collect blackberries, but... Oh well, better late than never. So we need to meet Caroline, we need to meet Marnie, we need to meet George. Okay, so let's do maybe Marnie first. I think being a Tuesday they do their exercises today... Well, there's Caroline. I think that's Caroline, isn't it? So we need to give you... Yeah, it is aerobics today. Okay, so we need to give... I think it was Caroline we give the pumpkin. Yep, so let's give the pumpkin to Caroline. Yep, she's very happy with that. So let's grab that. 500 gold, that's pretty good. And hopefully we can catch Marnie walking this way. I don't think there's anything we need to buy from Pierre today. So let's see if we can catch Marnie as Jody. Now I do think Marnie does aerobics as well, so she should be... There she is, walking in that direction. Ah, oh, Shane's her nephew. There we go. Now I think we need to do George next, and then um, Linus. So I think George will be in his house, which should just be here. Yep, he's just watching TV. Looks like another gloomy day. Well, let's let's spice it up with a hot pepper. Took you long enough. Well, I suppose that's fair. Well, at least it's good and spicy. At least, thank you. No worries, George. As he glitches backwards and forwards in his chair. So before we check with Linus, let's maybe quickly check on the beach to see if there's a nautilus shell. And there we go. There's a nautilus shell. Perfect. But we might check to see if there's anything else here while we're down here. We might even grab these. Oh, I, I always do that. Come on. Oh, it's really annoying. Okay, and let's grab that so we can put that back and put bait in. And is there anything over on this side? Just a coral. Anything else? Uh, another coral, but not another nautilus shell. I don't. I want another nautilus shell because when you hand it into the community center, you don't actually get that counted as a shipped item. So you need to get two to make sure that you can get those that count. Um, we might even check if it's anyone's birthday today, because um, I do want to start working on social again, and for year two as well. Is it anyone's birthday? No, but it's Linus's tomorrow, so we'll have to make sure we get something for Linus tomorrow. Um, we also want to keep checking for, you know, actually before we do anything, let's, let's go in the community, cent community center and let's hand in those couple of items that we've got. Ah, oh, that's the last one. So we got another complete bundle finished, which I think is friendship. So we'll get friendship boost for everyone. And we also got a recycling machine. Not too exciting, but not too bad nonetheless. So that's our bottle lesson done. So a complete new board. So we've only got the forage items left. When we're done here, we'll return to the other world. Thank you, Junos. And my mouse looks like it's frozen. Hopefully that picks up. Yep, it does. Good. So most of this is finished. We've only really got this room to do. And I think by memory we've got a crocus on us. Yes, we do. So we just need a snow yam, which we should be able to get. Hopefully not too long away. So hopefully we can walk around today, and if we collect a snow yam, on the second of winter we'll finish the community center, which is pretty remarkable, I think. But it could take us a while to find a snow yam. If, worst case scenario, we should be able to get a snow yam from the winter seeds that we have planted yesterday. Now, I think they take about seven days to finish, so hopefully we'll find one before then. There's Linus just there. Oh, we've got a pan. Do we have our pan on us? No, we don't. First time in a while that we don't. Um, but the snow yams only appear in my basket. Thank you. means a lot to me. So we've got 500 gold from that, and 200 gold for George. So short, mere short. So you need to have two stars with Marnie. And we've got plenty of stars of money. Okay, so let's go get the mayor shorts as well. And we can tick all these missions off today. So it's something we should have probably done a while ago. Actually, I wonder if that's all boosted because we got that 
Yeah, I think that's what happened. I think everyone got two... Oh, no, these people haven't. Okay. I was just wondering, because we finished that community center bundle for friendship, whether or not we just gave hearts to everyone, but it doesn't look like everyone got them. Unless people have been in negative because we haven't been speaking to them, that could be a possibility. I guess we'll have to check tomorrow. Normally it, it happens on the, the next day. So we should be able to get... Whoops, what have I done? That's me pressing the wrong area. Hopefully that hasn't interrupted with fraps at all. It is very strange in winter not having the same music. It feels very much like me talking to myself a lot more than normal. Um, so there's the mayor's shorts. And now we can go in here. So the mayor's lucky shorts in Marnie's room. Something very odd's going on. But we might leave it at that. We're not going to talk too much about what's going on there. Consenting adults and such. But where's Lewis hiding today? So we did see him before outside near his car. And I always struggle to find Lewis. He walks around all over the place. And he can be very challenging to find. So maybe we'll just keep the shorts on us at all times. And hope that we can just walk past him at some point and find him. The other good thing about me walking around at the moment is I'm looking for worms to see whether or not we can find a yam, but there hasn't been any. Maybe he's inside here. Yep, there's Lewis. So Lewis, we uh, we found your shorts. What's what's uh, what's going on there? You found them? Where? Oh, um, hmm. There, I have no idea how they could have got there. I'm sure, Lewis. This stands between you and me, got it? Sure. And maybe Marnie. We might talk to Marnie about it later. Um, so I think that's that's it. What else have we got? So we've got Jody's request. What does Jody want? I think Jody wants a cauliflower. So we probably forgot that one. And then catch a squid. So maybe we can even try catching a squid tonight. So it won't be a full day of fishing, which is what I want to try to avoid if I can. But if we can maybe get lucky tonight and catch a squid, that'll be useful. So, we need a cauliflower. Maybe we can catch Jody as well. Do we have any cauliflower? We don't. Have I seriously sold all my cauliflower? There's none in there. Is there any hiding in here? No, nope. it looks like we've got no cauliflower at all. Last check in here. Nope, looks like we've got rid of all our cauliflower. So that was probably a mistake of mine. But, oh well, these things happen. Um, we need to clear some space for... For our fish trip, so let's maybe put that in there. That'll go in there. We'll sell that. I think that's probably close enough. But unfortunately, it's going to take us a while to get our our um, mission with uh, Jody finished. I missed that one, so we're not going to be able to do that. Let's see if we can catch a squid. Actually, before we do that, I think we have to bit there at six. So we've got a little bit of time. But before we do that, I might even grab some more bug meat and we'll make some more bait. But I also want to make um, one of these lures. So that one there. Cause fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. That is the main one I use when I'm fishing. I think it's probably one of the best because it makes your bar go down slower. Um, the other ones just make it easy to catch a... F what was that? Ten sap. Okay, that's well, more sap than I thought. There we go. Let's just grab that. And we'll grab a couple more of these. So, the other bobbers increases the size of your fishing bar. That's not too bad. That one only makes your bite rate increase. So it doesn't actually make it easy to catch harder fish. Same with the dressed one. Treasure Hunter makes you find more of those. Barbed hook works for easy fish, but on the hard fish it actually makes it actually harder to catch fish than easier. So we're not going to be using that one, but we are going to be using these trap bobbers, and they're the ones I, I typically use. And we're also going to get some more bait. You know, we might as well finish that out. So heaps more bait. So now let's head down and let's see if we can catch a squid. Squid can be quite difficult to catch. Um, which is the other reason we want to try with that bobber. So that should make it a bit easier for us. And if we see... Well, if we see Jody, it's not going to matter because we can't actually finish that. 
But let's see if we can get lucky and fish up a squid. So I think, I think, let's just check, I think it tells you when. Catch a fish from the ocean on winter nights. So that should be right. So let's see how we go. And it looks like Willie's gone up to the saloon, so we should be able to find him if we, um... If we do catch a squid, that should be easy enough. Hopefully we can get something good from one of these chests too, because we haven't really got too many artifacts. Just a simple sardine. About a couple of geodes. We, I suppose we still need geodes um, to get all our minerals. We don't have all of those just yet. This one looks a little bit more difficult, but I don't think this is a squid. By memory, squid are quite difficult to catch. I don't know whether or not you need to have it raining or snowing to catch a squid. I can't actually remember. Um, I'm sure I can check the wiki. If, it's, if we don't get it today, well, it's apparently snowing tomorrow, so we could try again tomorrow. Um, but yeah, today I don't know whether or not we'll be able to, but we'll keep trying. In Willy's uh, mission, it just did say night time. It didn't actually say whether or not it has to be snowing, but he may not have mentioned that one. As we catch more and more seaweed. Come on. So as you probably noticed, um, spring, summer and fall was very much about getting as much gold in our economy going. Winter, not so much. So we've sort of got everything set up. We've got our greenhouse done, which is the main sort of source of gold for us in winter. We do have our animals as well. Um, and we've also got lots... Oh, this one looks a bit tricky, so maybe this is a squid. Um, and we've also got all of our... So as you can see, the bar's going down a lot slower now that we've got this um, cage, which makes it a lot easier. Is that a squid? Yeah, it is. We might even might as well catch a few more while we're here. And there's no reason not to. Um, so yeah, so there's another squid. So it's not um, not something where we make a whole lot of gold, but I'm actually not as interested in making a whole lot of gold. I like to sort of set up my farm as quickly as possible so we can make lots and lots of gold. And then in winter and year two, actually go a little bit slower and do a lot of the things that we skipped up, skipped over while still being able to utilize the greenhouse and all of our kegs to still get a decent amount of money flowing through. And that way we can spend time getting things like social and all those other elements that we haven't been getting so far. So I'll be focusing on social, maybe cooking up different recipes of things we haven't really been getting to date, and th things like that. So that'll be our year two. Um, hopefully we get some kids as well along the way, which should be great. Um, and that'll be our main sort of focus for year two. So what time is it? 8.20. We probably don't need to spend too much more time fishing, although that being said, we still do need to get our fishing level up, so we might as well spend the time today. It hasn't been a whole day of fishing, and it won't be, because I don't really want to have too many complete days of fishing. I can't imagine it makes for the most exciting viewing, but I will, will probably have a couple of double episodes throughout winter where I spend two days in a row fishing, but I probably will skip through the majority of fishing and just sort of show what I've captured throughout the day. If there's anything else anyone has an interest for me to do or try to do in winter, just, just let me know in the comments and I'm happy to have a crack at that. It's not as important to, like I said before, maximise the economy, so if there's things you want me to try to do or test, um, now is probably the appropriate time because we've got lots of kegs, we've got lots of money throwing, we've got plenty of um, star fruit, which will give us heaps and heaps of gold. So now is a really good time. Speaking of time, it's now 9.20. I'll probably head back a little bit after 10.30, um, maybe sell some things, see if we can catch Willy on the way back, um, give him one of the squid, and finish that um, mission as well. And that will be very good. The other thing I want to do in year two is aim to catch all of the fish and ship all of the items. And just get as many things towards Granddad's um, 
sort of points as we can. But that being said, I'm pretty confident that we will probably get enough points in year one to tick all the boxes, even though, or to get enough points at least, even though we won't be able to get a reward till the end of year two. We should have enough um, points by the end of year one. So I think the community center, when you finish that, gives you three points. I think getting a million gold gives you five points. Having all of your um, skills max gives you two points, so that's ten points there. And then what else? Um, I think I'm missing... Oh, getting married I think gives you a point. And then maybe getting hearts with your dog, or making a dog or pet love you gives you a point. And I think we'll probably get all of those by the end of year one. Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else I may have missed. I think if you get eight hearts with five people, that also gives you one. We're probably not going to get that in year one uh, because we haven't really been focusing too much on social. But that's something we'll probably easily get in year two. I think if we completely focused on that, we might be able to get five, but I don't think we will. So it's 10.50 now, so we might head back, but hopefully we'll see Willie on the way. And we'll be able to give him the squid. Where's Willie? He might be still in the saloon. Yep, and people are starting to leave now. So where's the squid? There's the squid. Let's say goodbye to Shane. What do you want from me? Money? I'd give you a pot of gold to leave me alone. What do we just get as an achievement? Shane, you're blocking the door. Come on. There we go. And let's talk to Willie. And let's give him a squid. Hey, you did it! Not bad, not bad at all. I'm impressed. Winter's a good time to break out the old fishing rod, isn't it? Yeah, it's not too bad. If you want Emily to like you, give her wool. You are aware that we're married, Clint. <laughs> let's talk to Pam. Give me another round. And let's talk to Gus. Please relax and enjoy yourself. Which is good, but probably not tonight. I'm going home. 800 gold from a squid, that's not too bad at all. And our horse is spazzing out for some reason, that's very weird. It's running a bit now, but yeah, I don't know what it was thinking before. Alright, let's sort out our inventory quickly, so let's sell that, and let's sell all the rest of our fish. Sell that, probably sell that too, might keep these on us. And what are we going to do? Let's put that away. We can probably just put this bait in there. We might as well put this out. Let's just put it there for the moment. It's getting late. Yep, noted. Um, what else have we got? Let's just put that away. Put... What was I thinking of? That away. And I think we can put those two in the casks. So let's put those there just for the moment. Nope, let's not do that. Let's put those there for the moment. The rabbit's foot we're going to hide in here, maybe. Let's just put those away. And I think this is probably the last thing. Say hi to our dog. And let's put these in here. And there's another free one. So we probably could have put something else in there, but we didn't. And it's 12.20, so we'll say goodnight to Emily, and we'll call it a night. It's a very cosy house. I like it. I quite like this house, too. Actually, you know what? Let's give you a cloth. This gift is fabulous. Thank you. Not a bad gift to give someone at 12.30 a.m. in the morning. Let's go to sleep. No fishing levels, so that's a little bit disappointing. But a decent amount of gold today. Just over 10,000. Just over 11,000. And the lobster sold for not as much as I thought it would. How much did the squid sell for? 150. Actually, that's not as much as I thought it would either. That was quite a tricky fish to catch. Um, truffle oil. Yeah, a little bit of gold from there. The wine didn't sell for too much, but that's a little bit of a gold boost. And we'll leave it there. And overnight, the community centre finished. I think, not the community centre, that bundle. Anyway, thank you all for watching this episode. I do hope you enjoyed it. And as always, please remember to like and subscribe. And besides that, I will see you all in the next episode. Thanks, everyone. See you later. Bye.